Good afternoon. Now at 5, a hazardous mess. More than a dozen barrels containing chemicals are dumped illegally in East Houston. Those chemicals are too dangerous to touch, and now it's going to cost the county tens of thousands of dollars to clean it all Chris up. Cost is live at the scene. What did you find out this afternoon there, Chris? Well, Len and Mia, this area is owned by Harris County. And if you look over there where those mattresses are, that's where crews spent a couple of hours today cleaning up those multiple barrels. They say some of them contained a mixture of concrete sealants and paint. Not a major public threat, but they say it's still not very good for the environment. Deputies also told us these types of cleanups can cost tens of thousands of dollars, money that taxpayers are ultimately responsible for. I guess everybody knows this is where you bring it. Precinct one deputies call this a trouble spot. They do characterize this as one of the larger illegal dumpings that they've seen. 17 barrels, two totes filled with chemicals and paint dumped illegally and now seeping into the ground near Elizabeth Hudnall's home. They don't care. It's just a dead end street to them. She's worried about the dozens of horses she boards, too. That's my friends. That's my buddies. Deputies say they've installed 125 cameras all over Harris County to catch people who break this law every day. This is a problem across Harris County that we're working every day to address. But cleaning up these sites is not cheap. Contracting a crew can cost thousands of dollars each time. Money taxpayers ultimately must pay, no matter where in the county it happens. It is our air. It is our water. We all breathe and drink the same air and water, and so it's incumbent upon our community to help us stop these crimes. Now, they say that this project was somewhere in the neighborhood of about $20,000 to clean up. They say an eyewitness gave them a description of the vehicle that actually dropped off all of these barrels and totes. They say it's a white, dually big rig pickup. They'd like to speak with the driver. They may charge that person with multiple felonies. They're asking anybody who sees illegal dumping in their area to call them on a hotline. We have that number posted on our website and also on the screen below. Len and Mia. All right.